Right, so let's talk about leads, leads captures, and you know what they're all about. As I said in the previous video, this is someone submitting a, a web form. Somebody, I consider it in the trade industry. You know, you would go. Um, so I work with security companies. So let's say I've just been out for lunch and I've heard that uh, the um, the pharmacy was broken into last night right so i'm going to put um if you know that if you know this information you put in as much as you can um west west end pharmacy uh you don't know the first name you've got to put a last name uh, just put manager if you don't know who you got to contact you're going to contact the manager title email you know nothing else right you're going to put um broken into last night alarm did not go off right and save now at that point it's just sat there as a lead as something that um you don't necessarily know has anything to do with it you don't know um you don't know what's going to happen to it you don't know whether you're going to follow it up because you'll want to be chasing your opportunities or your deals that are already in the pipeline. So it's a back burner one. Um, I'm not sure we test data. It's, there's going to be a lot of um, today's leads and they're all going to be today. But, so it's going to be the last one. But if you'd just done it with no test data, it would have been the first one, right? So when I come to it, you can then assign a task or something to it to... Uh, to chase it up to go after this what are you going to go after it i'm saying you can assign yeah activities it always it, it's messed me up a little bit lately because it used to say add task here but now it says open activities and you click the plus new task subject is call find out more something like that right when you're going to do it i'm going to do it by the end of next week um priority i'm going to put as high owners me it's not going to repeat uh, more details you can put uh, you can put here broken into need to chase up right and done so you're going to save that and on your home page uh, you're going to get and again because it's because it's, it's their test data it, you're going to see in your open task here and before next week I've got to do this related to that right so when you come to your CRM you're now looking through your tasks what do I need to do oh let me chase up that job you know I'm looking through my leads what am I interested in you know so then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this job and I'm going to make a phone call to the pharmacy so I'm going to add log a call um, uh, initial um interest something like that right you, you'll know what you put call purpose prospecting right related to account and outbound one it, obviously it's outbound uh your account you can't tag from a deal i think from a lead uh current call so if you put current call you can track its time and it'll start calling um I'm, if you tag to skype i think it'll actually try and call them but i'm going to put completed call uh, and it took. I did it today, at you know uh, 4 p.m. 4:30 or not 4:30 a.m. 4:30 p.m. and we talked for 30 minutes. Uh, called to see if I can arrange a meeting. Call result. Meeting next week game on billable now or it may be if you're doing it call start time oh call start less than or equal to current time all right so it's not 4 30 it's uh it's only it's only 2 40 here right so that has then logged the call initial interest call and find out more you've done so you can tick that tag task off but now you need to add a meeting right add an event a new event uh, initial meeting All right location pharmacy what time 
you know, 11 o'clock till, yeah, we're going to say we're going to be there an hour and a half, right? Oh, I don't know why I said an hour and a half. Uh, participants, so if you've got more salesmen, you could add them, obviously, um, or, and you can add actual the contacts. So if you add a contact here, we'll do this again later on the uh, an actual deal, but you could add a contact of who's going to be there. Lead, lead, uh, and save, right? So now you've got a meeting in your open activity for next week. But what we're going to do with this deal is we are now, it's game on. It's an opportunity now. We've identified, we've made a phone call and the person's interested to go further with us. So now we're going to convert it to a contact, right? So the create, create a new deal for this account. So there's a, the new account is going to be the pharmacy. The contact will become the manager and we can edit this information as we go in. And we know there's a deal on, so we're going to tick to say deal. We're going to say it's a £1,500 deal. The deal name is um, Alarm System and CCTV. Maybe something like that, right? I'm going to make this a, I'm going to make this a $5,000 deal, pound. I'm going to give myself a month to close it because it's still early days or whatever you decide. And... Uh, you need to you can decide where you are in the stage so we might say value proposition we're going for a meeting and we're going to sell we're going to um, give the proposition of what value you can bring so the campaign source is what we said in the other lesson uh if you had a campaign you would you would tag it to it so we could put um just for examples because we can show it later we're going to put um, yellow pages right because we can use it in a bit as well yellow pages active first of the year to the end of the year right so obviously we know that it wasn't from the yellow pages but expected revenue 10,000 is that 10,000 or a thousand 10,000 second guessing save and associate so it's going to tag that this deal is going to get tagged to yellow pages so if you sign off five thousand from a yellow pages ad you know it was worth it if you can get a few more in the year contact role you are talking to the decision maker and you convert it so now we've got a account a contact and a deal and in the next lesson we'll go into that